Uh, greetings, beloved co-creators. I am Gilles Mancillon and I come to you very briefly today to, to speak of the game of life. Why am I here? It's a big question that man has been asked for a long time. Uh, in a sense, uh, there is no meaning uh, given to life, but we, we come into encountering situations that give our life meaning, and so uh, there is much meaning will be uh, revealed. In a sense, we, we come from, from uh, a realm of infinite light, and so we, 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 did, we choose to descend into the, this reality in order to partake, to play within this holographic matrix that is the third dimension. In order to do that, we have to choose an avatar body, so that is a physical body, um, which is multidimensional. This avatar body is made up of the ego, the physical self, and the, the holographic uh, uh, bioelectrical uh, production of our cells, cellular structure that makes up this physical body. Then we have an astral and emotional body, which is the body of desire as well, that's fourth dimension. And then we have a, a light hyperspace uh, physical presence in the fifth dimension where the soul is projecting this whole, uh, um, this whole show, this, this, uh, this this incredible uh, universal production that call reality. Uh, essentially, what uh, uh, we, we have, um, we have our programs, which is a DNA. That's what our souls work with and work from. It is the point is to activate the dormant part within ourselves, so we can activate our, our psychic powers and perception become more clear. When the 3D game is over, unless you have fully understood the whole level of 3D, you are moving into 4D or 5D, 5D. Uh, otherwise, uh, usually you have to let go of your avatar body, a process we call death, and then you re-emerge in the fourth and fifth dimension. There you are met with your soul, your spirit guides, and, and you, you, you can review the, the, the last games you, you've played, and then choose to reintegrate the matrix, uh, the, cycle of, uh, the cycle of eternity, until you we get it, we're going to be going through that. Uh, not everyone on the earth is playing on the same level, not even the same field. Uh, it's just some people are playing totally different ball games, but uh, uh, everybody's working on this level, and so we have to accept that there are some people that are working below us and others that are working above us. Um, each level is, uh, is about overcoming obstacles and challenges, no matter what level we are on, we always have obstacles and challenges to overcome. Um, we want to concentrate on the present, the present time, the present life, and so to turn potential into actual as much as possible. So that is the, the game of the divine. God wants to make all the potential actual. Uh, you want to be able to play on your level. You, you don't necessarily want to um, worry about the other level or whatever. Just be comfortable in your program. Stick to your program as much as possible. Whatever is being taught in your mind, just with what you have to follow, your higher, highest potential. It is, a, it is kind of paradoxical because in, in time and space, when we look at the past, we look at all these old things we no longer want, and when we look at the future, we have this hope and something for something better. But w from an ascended perspective, the past has become the resting place because those are the challenges that have been overcome, and the future is about unmet obstacles and challenges, so it is about the uncertainty, so the, the, the table will be turned in the future. So that's, that was the essence of my message. I hope you're enjoying your, your game today. It's a, it is a quite a, it's, it's a very interactive program, that this, this holographic matrix of the Earth. Uh, but we are multidimensional. We have also access to a higher level of programming within ourselves that will make these host games a lot more uh, uh, sensitive, a lot more integrated for once we, we, we connect to our, to, to our more um, intuitive aspect where we are more able to utilize the potential for highest growth and highest potential for the highest good of all. Well, I hope my message was interesting for you. I wish you a wonderful day and I'll talk to you later. Namaste.